We are here today to do first episode of Virtual Reality Showcase, a show in which I'm going to look and show you some cool upcoming PSVR 2, PC VR, Quest 2 and 3 and everything else Virtual Reality games. We've got tons of them to look at. The rules are simple, you'll be able to see maybe same game in multiple episodes, but it's always going to be a new footage. Also, I'm gonna try to do those videos once or twice a week because there's so many games in the development. And let's just have fun. Subscribe, press a like, share the video. Let's go. Assetto Corsa Evo takes the acclaimed franchise to the next level with groundbreaking realism. Developed by Kunos Simulazioni, it features a new high-performance engine that delivers stunning photorealistic graphics, dynamic weather and advanced virtual reality and triple screen support. Players can choose from variety of cars from road vehicles to hypercars and race cars, all beautifully modeled to reflect their real-world mechanical, electronic and aerodynamic characteristics. Tracks are crafted using laser scan technology for unmatched accuracy. Key features, new engine, photorealistic visuals, dynamic weather and advanced asphalt performance simulation. Diverse vehicles, cars from different eras, including road cars, classics and hypercars. All recreated with authentic handling and physics. Unmatched realism, enhanced vehicle and track accuracy, combined with improved virtual reality for deeper immersion. Virtual reality support is confirmed for the PC version, allowing for a fully immersive driving experience. However, there is no confirmation about PlayStation VR 2 support yet. But stay tuned, as more details might be revealed closer to PlayStation 5 release date. The game will release on PC this year, with a PlayStation 5 version expected later. On PlayStation 5 it's expected to run in 4K at 60fps, which might suggest that virtual reality support is on the cards. But of course there won't be a PS4 version, as Kunos focuses on current gen capabilities. Subside launching on September 17, 2024 is an immersive aquatic VR experience developed and published by A2D. Designed for PC VR, the game offers players a highly realistic underwater world where they can explore diverse aquatic environments and interact with lifelike marine creatures. It aims to replicate the intricities of real shallow water swimming and diving, providing an unparalleled sense of immersion. The developer have also announced on their social media that following the PC release, PlayStation 5 and PlayStation VR 2 versions will be available at later date. So stay tuned to the channel and as soon as I got any information regarding PS5 and PSVR 2, I will be doing video right away of course, but for now PC VR players can enjoy it in just few days time. Aces of Thunder set for release in fourth quarter of 2024 is an exciting new virtual reality flight simulation game from Gajin Entertainment, known for its hit War Thunder. Designed to take full advantage of the latest virtual reality technology, the game delivers high fidelity graphics and a deeply immersive experience. Players will engage in aerial combat using a range of beautifully recreated World War II aircraft, including the American P-51 Mustang, German BF-109, Soviet Il-2, British Spitfire and Japanese A6M-3-0. Battles in Aces of Thunder are fought exclusively from the cockpit view, enhancing immersion and realism. 
the game features detailed interactive cockpits, allowing players to physically manipulate controls and experience the thrill of flight firsthand. HOTAS support is confirmed. Players can explore 15 beautifully crafted maps representing key theaters of World War II, the Western, Eastern and Pacific fronts. In addition to single player missions, because yes, there is single player missions in this game, maybe this is something what is not spoken enough, but yes, there is single player. In addition to single player missions though, the game offers intense multiplayer dogfighting, which is the main focus of the game, where players can test their skills against others worldwide. Native support for OpenXR ensures compatibility with a wide range of virtual reality devices on PC, while the game's VR-specific optimizations promise a comfortable and engaging experience. Aces of Funder will be available on both PlayStation VR 2 and PC VR platforms, Gaijin Entertainment has confirmed that the game will be releasing on those platforms in fourth quarter 2024, with more details, including pricing and exact release date, to be announced closer to launch. So once again, stay tuned to the channel, because something will be announced very, very soon. Batman Arkham Shadow is set to redefine the virtual reality experience with its immersive take on the Batman universe. Launching in October 2024, this new entry in the Arkham franchise allows players to step into the gritty world of Gotham City like never before. Developed by Camouflage and published by Oculus Studios, the game takes place after the events of Batman Arkham Origins, presenting a fresh narrative with an original villain, the Rat King, who leads a cult threatening Gotham. The game fully embraces virtual reality, offering a detailed and interactive experience where players can engage in dynamic combat and stealth sequences. You wield familiar gadgets and execute hard-hitting combat moves, all from the iconic Arkham series but reimagined for virtual reality. The game features a deep narrative with familiar characters, such as Dr. Quinzel and Harvey Dent, alongside exploring iconic Gotham locations like the Monarch Theater and Bowery. Batman Arkham Shadow is bold to leverage the latest virtual reality technology, promising a high level of immersion with intuitive controls and realistic gameplay. From prowling Gotham's dark alleys to soaring through the city with Batman's cape, the game delivers a compelling and interactive adventure. The game will be available exclusively on MetaQuest 3 with a price yet to be announced. Stay tuned for further updates as the release date approaches. Get ready to dive back into the zombie apocalypse with Arizona Sunshine Remake, a complete overhaul of the acclaimed virtual reality shooter, 
set in the harsh and desolate Grand Canyon state, this remake brings the original game's gripping experience to a new level with stunningly enhanced visuals and next-generation virtual reality gameplay. As you explore the soon scorched landscape, you need to fend off relentless zombie hordes using an arsenal of motion controls weapons, including shotguns and machetes. The game's revamped graphics feature high-resolution textures and lifelike environment details, creating a truly immersive experience. In addition to updated visuals, Arizona Sunshine Remake includes all previously released DLC, like Deadman DLC and The Damned DLC, seamlessly integrating them into the game for a complete experience. You can tackle the campaign solo or team up with friends in co-op multiplayer mode for up to four players. Be aware though, more players means more zombies. The remake introduced a new mutilations and gore system, enhancing the thrill of combat with even more visceral interactions. Step into a new dimension of hilarity with Humans Fall Flat VR, a fresh take on a beloved physics-based puzzler. This virtual reality mode transforms the game with an intuitive third-person view tailored specifically for virtual reality, allowing you to control each arm of your human avatar with your own hands, adding an unprecedented level of physicality to the gameplay. Experience all the classic levels from the original Humans Fall Flat, alongside an array of extra dreams crafted by top community creators. Whenever you navigate in treacherous industrial environments, or sleeping through a snowy alpine wonderland, you encounter familiar challenges in a stunning new way. The Virtual Reality Edition maintains the series' signature co-op fun, letting you team up with up to three friends. Together you tackle physics-based puzzles and avoid traps with a fresh perspective. Dress your human in a wide variety of outfits, from skydiver to a chef, and customize your look with a selection of colors. Human Fall Flat VR began its life as a mod for the flat version, and the developers enjoyed this mod so much that they bought it and now are releasing it as an official virtual reality game. Dive into revamped experience and discover just how entertaining the game can be in virtual reality. And now my most favorite game of today's video, because it's inspired by two of my favorite flat games. Ember Souls invites you into breathtaking virtual reality adventure, combining the thrill of hack and slash combat with the finesse of parkour and climbing. As the last immortal, you embark on a previous quest to defeat the enigmatic Shadow Sultan. Inspired by classics like Prince of Persia and Assassin's Creed, the game immerses you in a richly detailed Persian palace across five stunning environments. In Ember Souls, your journey is marked by dynamic sword fighting with over 20 diverse weapons and enemies, enhanced by advanced physics and a gore system. The game's innovative parkour system allows you to perform acrobatic climbs and wall jumps, creating a sense of fluidity and agility reminiscent of a seasoned warrior. The virtual reality environment encourages creative problem solving through intricate environmental puzzles and deadly traps. Manipulating the space around you, whether it's climbing, moving objects or using abilities, adds layers of depth to your exploration. Harness the power of ember stones to slow time. Create energy shields 
or only shockwaves to stun foes. Those abilities, combined with the freedom to use a grappling hook, provide a variety of ways to engage with the game's challenges. Overall, Ember Souls promises blend of combat, climbing and puzzle solving set against the backdrop of a beautifully crafted Persian world. Whether scaling walls or engaging in epic battles, you experience a thrilling adventure with every step. And this concludes today's virtual reality showcase. Let me know in the comment section which games grabbed your attention. Of course, there's loads more to come. I couldn't fit them all in one episode, but this is only episode one and I will be doing more of those videos alongside gameplay and news videos and reviews as well on this channel. So stay tuned for future content and for today, thanks for watching and that's it. Bye bye bye.